Greetings from the Environmental Engineering Program of Montana Technological University. I am Kumar Ganesan. I am the current department head. I have been here for about 40 years. Uh, we are very excited and very proud to celebrate our 50th year anniversary of the program. The program started in 1971 and received ABET accreditation in 1982. And we have graduated nearly 1,000 graduates in the uh, five decades. And those graduates are doing outstanding work in the field of uh, environmental engineering with innovative technologies, solving problems, complex problems. And one of the problems they have solved in the past years is the Superfund site across Montana and regionally that provided the, uh, improved the quality of life for several communities uh, around Montana and neighboring areas. Our faculty and graduates have done excellent research during this time, and we have received uh, multiple funding from DOE, US EPA, USDA, NSF, and other agencies in several millions of dollars. And I am hoping in the future, because of our uh, improvement in research capabilities and newer equipments and instruments, and we'll be able to attract uh, several uh, new research programs in the coming 50 years. Hi, my name is Maggie Olson, and I just started in the master's program in the environmental engineering department. And I'm studying under Raja Nagasetti's research group. And currently we're out on the German Gulch and Silver Bow Creek confluence where there's about a three to five degree temperature difference. And previous studies within his research group have found that temperature is the limiting factor in West Slope cutthroat trout populations. And so what I'm trying to do is look at specific regions where um, we can use the drone and thermal imagery to develop a thermal map and try to assess where these cold water inputs are so that we can find some potential cold water refuge habitats for these species. These thermal maps will then be used to aid in the design of future projects that will hopefully enhance, protect, and create more habitat for these species of trout. Even though I'm new here and uh, you know haven't been here long, I can tell that this is a really great community that I've found myself in. People are quick to help, quick to get together, and uh, quick to provide any sort of um, assistance with research or equipment. Um, it's been really great so far and I'm really excited to embark on this arduous journey ahead of me. So I'm currently a senior project manager at Pioneer Technical Services um, and my degree here at Tech most has helped me be able to be a problem solver and work through the tough situations I deal with um, both technically and um, the multiple stakeholders I deal with and just having the confidence to approach problems and find a solution to them. Favorite part of it was the kind of the community you feel with, or at least the, the smallness of the program. Um, you got to know your professors. You weren't just a number. Um, everybody knew everybody by name. And the classes were small, so you really got to know the peers you were with and who you were working with and working with teams. Um, and there's still some of the graduates that I talk to and I'm connected to. And that, that was a big thing for me.